Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Melissa here and I've got this hair tutorial for you today. But before we start, have you subscribed to my channel yet? No? You could do it right now if you like. I'm pausing the video just for you. Okay, done? Let's continue. Um, so as always, our first step is to use a heat protector and comb it through. I will list all the products I use in this video in the description box below. So make sure you click on the small down arrow button that everyone misses. My first tip is if you wash your hair before curling or even straightening, make sure your hair is completely dry. I don't usually straighten my hair prior to curling but it definitely makes it easier to pick up strands and see what you've curled. Split your hair into two sections like so. If your hair is longer, you may need more clips than me. Using my GHD Gold Classic Styler, I take a small section and start curling away from my face. You can see I only curl from about an inch from my roots by dragging the flat iron diagonally and leave the ends. If you drag it horizontally, the curls will be bouncier and vertically will make them more wavy. We're doing hours somewhere in between as I can't decide so we go diagonal. I skipped the video a little forward because um, focus and angle weren't right and uh, you wouldn't be able to see what I was doing properly so I'm really sorry about that. I'll show you a few more and then we will speed up the video. A tip I can give you, if you end up having some parts that are curlier than others, you can simply straighten them out a little, like I do it here. I'm now adding Paul Mitchell Super Skinny Serum to my curls. This will smooth and give your hair more shine and doesn't straighten out my curls at all. It might be my hair type but if it doesn't work for you, you can surely um, skip this step and go straight to adding hairspray all over your hair. Style it a little and it's done. I hope you liked the video and gave me a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel to give me some love and thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye!